cinema, like film festivals, provide you a chance to see something new and find something new you may really enjoy. And that's why I encourage people to do it. And there's too many Spider-Man movies. That's <laughs> the big thing. Ruchan has a you know, particular section about Asian cinema, which is not always there in the other bigger festivals. So it really does play a big role in promoting Asian cinema. A lot of people from all over the world are here. Um, I think that having it in Busan and having people come here and be able to watch Korean and films from other Asian countries is a uh, really, really big role that Busan has taken on. You know, the cinema has been uh, you know, very dominated by uh, European and you know Hollywood. Uh, influence. You know, really few venue uh, allowed Asian filmmakers uh, can share their you know creative work and also raise their voice. One of the key things was that from the very beginning, this festival decided to focus not just on Korean cinema but on Asian cinema as a whole and kind of young, up-and-coming Asian filmmakers. There really was no other film festival doing that. Directors in small countries from across Asia who don't have a lot of film infrastructure and if they make films, like it's hard to get them released in their own countries and it's hard to get them shown abroad. I think it's more like the opportunities that you can get funding from kind of like one of the most famous and now the kind of the biggest festival in Asia and then it's kind of the way to at least to screen your film. I mean even you are kind of young and new filmmaker and then there's a space or there's a chance to show or screen the film. Very big festival, you get a lot of international guests. So, I mean for example, we're about to go see a Mongolian film. I've never seen a film from Mongolia before so I think it's really nice the ability to go see films from all sorts of countries. I think during the first 20 years of the festival, it was very clear kind of what uh, its goal was to grow bigger and to grow more influential. Now I think the festival is kind of reaching a more mature stage. Uh, there are disagreements. Some people are not happy with the Busan. Some people are very happy with the Busan. And there's always disagreement. But Regardless of whether you are happy or not, uh, there is a common uh, kind of agreement. That is, we need to help Busan International Film Festival to grow. There is co collective support uh, towards the festival. So I, I think the future is very optimistic. How to contribute to the de development of Asian cinema? That assignment will be uh, there are those leaders, you know, Busan Film Festival directors and Korean Film Council a chairperson and a, a Film Academy chairperson, they will work together, you know, to help, you know, the, the development of Asian cinema. And certainly things are changing very quickly and, I mean, we all know that China's growing bigger and bigger and will surpass the U.S. in terms of market size. Uh, but also Indonesia and Vietnam are growing very quickly. And I mean that provides some opportunities for filmmakers. Korea, you know, Japan and that those are East Asian countries and Southeast Asian country and also even Central Asia, like Kingdom of Bhutan, Tibet, you know. I think these all you know, based on these differences, very interesting differences in language and culture, you know, we have a really good resource to, to make film, good film, good story. It's not just like, a, oh, you know, okay, I, I'm going to, as a director, I'm going to uh, cast Singaporean actress and Indonesian actor to reach to this Indonesia and Singapore market. You know, that's a very old way, you know, <laughs> very old way of approach. Like that's what Hollywood doing a co-production with China, mainland China, and they failed in that way, right? 
So, you know, in that sense, it's more fundamental co-production, you know, the, uh, you know, from script development stage, you know, up to the, you know, distribution. I think uh, this kind of a new film movement will be coming. Uh, when I did made the decision, you know, to relocate to Singapore, I, w I was very aware about that. You know, this new film movement is starting from Southeast Asia. You know, this it's really emerging, and I want to be part of it. I want to make that, you know, Asian, you know, film, you know, in, during that movement. Yeah.